Well, it's very difficult to describe because it really it's a nerve-wracking time and, and uh, yeah, it's, it's butterfly stuff, it really is. <laughs> Vaughan, what makes the Vodacom Durban July the race to win? Michelle, I think because uh, for so long it's been touted as, as the race in South Africa. Um, some of us d disagree, but, uh, you know, we'll have a crack at it. And, and it's just nice to have it on your CV. It's a wonderful feat to, to win a race like that because it takes a lot of hard work and you have to have the right horse. So what's the right type of horse? He's got to have a lot of speed and he's got to see out the extra 200 metres, which, you know, there are not too many races of that calibre and this class. So the 2,000 metres of the Met and the Daily News is one race, but the extra 200 of the Vodacom July is the testing part. And you have to have a horse that, that sees it out, you know. Three-year-olds have a good record in the Vodacom Durban July, with nine having won in the last 20 years of which seven have been colts or geldings. Well, I think you have to be a very good three-year-old to, to, to take part in the July, and, and of course you've got to be well-weighted. There's some horses, three-year-olds in the past 20 years, or whatever it is, that possibly could have won the July, but didn't run in the July because they were weighted too highly. But, you know, my two geldings have got 53 kilos, which is a very, very handy weight, and with that weight, I'm sure they'll be competitive. Are linebacker and Rascalian similar in any way? No, not at all. Uh, uh, linebacker is really laid back and, and um, it's, you could put a bomb under him in the trade ring as you've seen and uh, nothing would worry him, whereas Rascalian is, is quite hyped up and, and gets himself into a bit of a state, which we've been working on and, and the last run was a big improvement, so you've got to be careful with him and, and uh, just handle him with kid gloves. But um, both, both very, very talented horses. So what's July fever like? Well, it's very difficult to describe because it really is a nerve-wracking time and, and uh, yeah, it's, it's butterfly stuff, it really is. <laughs> That's wonderful and I think Linebacker really wants to chat to you and have a word with you. He's quite gorgeous. You spend a lot of time with your horses, Vaughan? Yes, I do, uh, Michelle. Um, you know, I handle them a lot, and, and not only me, my, my assistant Adele and, and um, all of my grooms have been brought up like that and taught like that, that they, the horses is the prime person in the yard and, and they are very kind to them. And, and you can see they're very well behaved horses. There's always lots of excitement leading up to the Vodacom Durban July. How are you feeling at the moment? About the same, I was feeling in, in late uh, March, very, very nervous and uh, <laughs> with high expectations, but very nervous, very, very nervous. And come race day? Well, uh, that's still to come, so we don't know, but um, up until that, it's just to put your head into the work and get on with it and occupy yourself. Yeah, and, and that, that's about it, you know, really just concentrate on the job at hand.